What up, YouTube? Yugi Zombie Queen here, coming at you with a deck profile from one of the top eights. What's your name and what did you get? Uh, I am, my name is Alfie Danklifson, and I got eighth place. I snuck in there. <laughs> yep, we did it. Awesome. What are you playing? <laughs> uh, the pile. Crusadia, Thunder Dragon, Orcus Danger. I'm totally going to do that as like a thumbnail of the, the pile. pile. The pile. <laughs> <laughs> all right, let's get into that. Uh, all right, so we play the best spell card in the game, Secus Light. Draws two cards. Really it's good. Uh, and then I played some Thunder Dragon cards. So we played not one, not two, but three Thunder what? Dragons. What? That's yeah. never seen. Thought about playing two. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> and then uh, two Thunder Dragon Dark. Uh, one roar and one hawk. Yeah. Um, don't need to play. You don't need to play these. You just need these. But these were really good. And then I played some Crusadia cards. Uh, three Maximus. He's the best one because he's a light. Uh, three Reclusia. Uh, she's really good because she pops cards. And then three Aborea. Uh, this one's good against Salamangrade if you go second. And then two Leonis. I just played this one as an extra name. And then one Drake. I was playing two, but I kept breaking with it, so I cut it down to one, and it didn't do me wrong. Nice. And then I played some dragon cards. Uh, three Levineer, best card right now, very good. Uh, his little brother, Brotar. And then the white and black dragon. The babies. Yeah, they're kind of bricks in this deck, but they get you there sometimes. And you definitely need them for the combo. Um, one Destrudo. Uh, I wasn't playing this until I summoned LP and didn't have a target, so then I yeah. put it in my deck. And I keep dropping cards. No! <laughs> Alright, so two Defrag Dragon. Um, I forgot my reason why I played this, but uh, maybe it was because of the Keen. Hey. Oh my god! Be my <laughs> and then I played uh, some Dangers, two Nessie, uh, two Suchinoko, free, two Jackalope, again free, and then Bigfoot, Thunderbird, and Mothman. Uh, Oof. I just played this one because sometimes you want to search a card that like makes you discard a specific card rather than a random card. Yeah. And then I played uh, some Orcus cards. So I played two Nightmare, a Harp Horror, a Skeleton, one Gizmek, and a Crescendo. What? No want? Yep. So it'll make more sense when we go into the extra deck. All right. Um, so for the extra deck... I played the one Colossus, don't need more than one, um, because you play this card. And this card gets the Thunder Dragon Roar out of your deck, and banishes it, and summons Thunder Dragon Dark, and then you search Hawk, and you do the full combo in the process. Yay, jump promo, RIP jump promos. <laughs> and then uh, I played the Magius Package, and then the Guard Dragons, LP Agrapain, Triple Burst, Hieratic Seal and the Crystal Wing. And then I played the Orcist Package, Nightmare Mermaid, Nightmare Phoenix, two Galateas, and the Dengirsu. So the reason I play Harp Horror and Skeleton is because uh, the Orcus combo is just so much better if you have them, because you get the Galatea and the Dengirsu with the Crescendo set, rather than just one or the other. And you play that spicy ulti? Yes. <laughs> Shout out to Brandon Teal for that. Uh, and then the last card I played was Black Lives Soldier, Soldier of Chaos. I put that in my Astro deck because I was having some trouble with Striker, and uh, this card's very good against Striker. They can't really beat it, um, especially if you use the Trishula Fusion and you banish the Ningirsu out of their extra deck. So they, most of the time, they don't actually have an out to it. Ever. Yeah, that card is broken. Very good. Yes. So if you do full combo with this with this deck, your ending board will look something like this. That's so broken. Yeah, and this will have two materials. Yeah, Compulse, no. Yeah, bounce face of card, no searching, no. negate and banish, can't be destroyed by battle, yep. can't destroy my cards, and, negates a monster effect. And just negates for days. Yep. But I really only full comboed like twice throughout the whole tournament. Everyone had hand traps and you know, like, crackdown or something like that. Sad day. But, yep. And then onto the side deck, I played three Rocky Boy. Didn't use it all day, but the card's nuts. Definitely played. Play it. Uh, two Lancia, two Pankertops, and two Phantasme. Um, I actually 
<laughs> I actually played a game against someone where I opened... Actually, you know, I did use this today. I opened up these three against some sort Seriously, of Orcus combo deck. something from your main deck. Yes. You <laughs> so he did his fifth summon, which was a Galatea, and I went... Uh, <laughs> Phantasme and then Nibiru. Nibiru attributed his monster summon and then Phantasme summoned and he no longer had any Link monsters, so I just drew a card. <laughs> because you draw cards equal to the number of Link monsters, they have plus one. So I just drew a card. Oh my gosh. Yep, and then I Lancia him after that and he just kind of scooped. <laughs> he was like, you opened the nuts, bro. And he did. <laughs> um, and then three twin twisters for back row decks. It wasn't enough. I just, I don't know how to beat trap cards. Uh, and then two eradi Eradicator Epidemic Virus for Striker, and then the Imperial Order for Striker as well. We, any shout outs you'd like to do? Uh, shout out to Matt Fox for coming with me. Uh, hey, shout it's his out girlfriend! To <laughs> Uh, shout out to Yeti Gaming for being the best sponsor around. Shout out to Ethan, of yeah, course. Yeah, what's up, boys? Um, all the great people I play Yu-Gi-Oh with. Uh, you for helping me out with my documentary. Sweet. All right, thank you. Of course.